What's going on, everybody? Last City Slum here, and back again with another weekly reset video. I uh, I want to take a second out to uh, to once again thank everybody who's had my back, man, and who stayed with me during these uh, these tough times. And you know, life just keeps knocking you down. It's what you do after that, man. And um, the only thing you can do is get up and continue fighting, right? Sometimes it may take a little bit longer than others to get up, but as long as you get up. And with saying that, let's get uh, let's get into the video. So I want to say that uh, I've had fun with these Guardian games. I had some platinum on my shoulder uh, this last week. As a matter of fact, this morning, <laughs> and uh, it made me feel pretty good. But now it seems to have reset. So having said that, the the training playlist is the uh, Arcadian Valley Proving Grounds. And, of course, these are going to be your strikes. So I want to get in there with my squad. You guys know who you are. We're going to get in there this week, and we're going to try to uh, to push the training grounds out, man, get them nightfall weapons, and uh, see what we can do. See if we can get platinum on both shoulders this week, man. We're, we're going we're gonna to push for it. Um, also, you guys look up there. Iron Banner is back this week, so that means double valor uh, for you guys who enjoy that. And, uh, man, I'm pretty sure Charles is out, so that's going to be pretty freaking brutal. Um, all right, let's check and see what's in the store. So, up for grabs. Now, I I tell you what. I didn't really think I was going to like these Guardian Games shaders, but some of them are pretty, pretty dope, man. Like, even this one, bro. Like, I, I still like this one to some effect. Now, what I'm waiting on, and I mentioned this to my squad. I, 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 I told the rest of the pride. I said, look, Halloween, we're getting the mech armor sets bro and some of these shaders that we'll be getting like the titan is supposed to get it's he's supposed to look like wing zero um and i'll uh i could post a picture maybe in this later on and uh or down in the comments maybe if it allows me to do that um if not then then we'll make another video maybe about all the different uh armor sets or the three different armor sets that are coming up for this halloween but for up for grabs is this one Man, you know me. I'm always going to pick up these freaking shaders, man. I love these shaders. Um, Laurel Wreath Projection. As long as you, like, I can you can get that for about 1,500. Jesus. Okay, for 700, you get Power Lift, the emote. Get it, boy. You got this. You got this. Prolapse butthole. <laughs> there he goes. He's got it, man. Remember that for 700. Now, for 2,500, you can get the Victory Lap Sparrow, which is just, it's just a little weird to me, man, but it's not bad. It's not bad. All right. So for the armor sets, the armor sets are going to come in around, what was it, 1,500? Uh, I did go ahead and pick the one up for the Titan because I really, I think this kind of drip, man, looks really good. And on the Titan, man, it doesn't look bad at all. So, um... Let's go on to show your competitive spirit. Now, in this one, we have Give Me a G, which is a group want. cheerleader emote for 1200 For 600 you get the backstroke shell. Looks like he's uh, I know it's got to be a freaking swimming cap, but it looks like a pair of underwear upside down, man. I'm just saying. And then I picked this up for the Vex Mythic class because I really, really like the way this looks. Class of its own. And... Um, I don't know, man. I just really like the dark looks and the uh, the yellow highlights with the blue and just all the colors in it are, are really awesome, I think. And we have Celebrate the Games with some flair. You have the Lawnmower. <laughs> the Lawnmower Sparrow. Then we have Hot Commodity. Which I like the way this ship looks, man. It, it's, it's pretty cool looking. Then we have the Champion Shell, Go Shell. You get those for about eight, and then six hundred. And next we have season. What did I say? Season of the Risen in Sued. For something in particular. So we have uh, the Gunslinger, which I love. I picked it up. It's, it's probably one of my all-time favorite emotes, man. I'm telling you guys, I am juicing this one all the time. And now we're you about a thousand. The best defense Titan finisher. We'll see that one more time because they. Not paying attention, they go pretty quick. Wow! 
Oh, now he did it from the other side. Will he do it from the other side this time? Nope. All right. Let's see if we go back in. Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. That's going to run you 800. So the Bel Air shell, which has got the fins like the old Chevy Bel Airs, that's going to run you about 600. Next we have <laughs> the scintillant set. I'm going to try and say that. So winning streak. Now this has the chemtrails exhaust that I like because see how smooth that looks right there? I love how it's like it's just cutting through water. I love the way that looks. Absolutely. That's running you an eight. The ship's going to run you at eight. I have this ship. I like the way the wings and everything look. Not and you can. The color of those wings will change. Uh, Bright Cycle Ghost Shell for 600. And then we have Reigning Champion. It's got the belt up there. He's showing that off. And then we have the Wedge. The Wedge Sparrow. Now that... That might be worth a pickup. I really like the way that looks. Oh, and it's got the exhaust like I like. Yep, that might be a done deal, man. That's setting in at uh, 800. I'm about to pick up some more today. And we have the champion shell with water break emote. Buddy of mine's got this one, Duke. And uh, was it Duke or is it? I think it's Duke or my buddy Cotton. I think one of them had this. And... Uh, I like that emote as well. And then, uh, okay, well, this doesn't say to today's, but Precise Strike. Mm -hmm. Not everything. That's a, uh, it's a very Titanish emote there. All right, then we will run down here to the Bright Dust site and see what we have. Now, Titan Projection. Bro, done freaking deal 1500 though my god 1500 for the titan projection but that is that is badass especially if you're a titan um then we have the air appearance triumphant which if you guys know if you don't know they're giving away the air apparent um in the guardian games uh they give you an exotic quest for it it's pretty easy to get um and it, like I said, even the catalyst. The catalyst is super easy to get to. And, uh, and man, it, it's a fun LNG. I mean, if you look at it, of course, it's got a spool up, but it has a uh, 900 rounds per minute once it's fully spooled, 200 rounds in a magazine. If you're wearing the freaking, oh, what is it, the war rig, then you're constantly feeding ammo back into it. And on top of that, if you have full health, it will give you an arc shield when you start spooling, which is pretty amazing. Uh, celebrated and elevated emo. This guy's happy. That's going to run you 1250. Um, Team Spirit Ship, which is, it's, it's different, man. It's pretty cool, too, though. That's going to run you 2000. Uh, the Lawnmower, as we just saw earlier, and that's going to run you 2500. For 2850, you get the sponsored shell. Now, I like. This shell a whole lot, man. The way it looks, it's got all the sponsors. You can see Tex over here, Dido, Clovis Bray. You got Norton Stall. You see the stores in the banks. I think that's actually one of the banks, I think. Um, then you flip over here. You got some Hake. Of course, you got Clovis Bray again. You got uh, Shuros. And uh, right here, you can see the Posa, Dido. And it's just a really cool, unique ghost show, man. I liked it, and I picked it up. There's uh, there's Dido with your, uh, with your bunny right there. See that, Jay Rabbit? And then we have Torch the Light, or Torch Light. You know what I'm saying. That one's going to run you a pretty penny at 32.50. We come over here for 450, Paraversal Singularity, Trans Manifest. It's pretty cool. Looking for anything in particular. Gideon? All right, then for 450, you get the Eldritch effects. And you get the sterile neutrino effects. All right, for shaders, we have Copper Brand. It gives you that copperish look. And we have Gloam Strife. 
Then we have Byzantium Lotus, which is a good deep, deep dark purple, man. And I, I love that deep purple. Then we have Bruised Blush, which is in there. a little bit of a lighter purple. If you look, it may have... Yeah, see the cross hatching, so it's got it's so it's kind of wants to give off that uh that carbon fibers look. All right, so we will take ourselves on over to Banshee, see what Banshee's got right now, and uh, then we'll make our our run down there to eight to one. You don't look too banged up. All right, so Banshee has counterbalance stock, freehand grip, backup mag, and sprint grip. Um, today he's got submachine gun, fusion rifles, rocket launchers, and stasis weapon bounties. Um, he has the scathe lock with multi-kill clip, under pressure, steady rounds, flared magwell, full bore, hammer forged, rifling with a handling masterwork. Now at a 600 RPM, the impact's not that bad. The range, stability, everything looks good on that. With a handling masterwork, man. 42 rounds, you don't like that? Grab you a freaking backup mag and throw it in there. Get you about 45, maybe closer to 50. Um, Syncopation 53 with uh, Shuros Energy, of course. Head Seeker, Compulsive Reloader. Grants increased reload speed when close to full magazine. Now, I don't know. I've been having a conversation with my buddies. I don't know. I want to find an AR... Uh, that has this on it, if because uh, I want to find out if not if the war rig works with it and it because it, it would constantly trigger the compulsive reloader you would think which increased reload speed. So if it just kept doing that, you know what I'm saying? It would it would have you would have to be reloading like crazy, like super fast. You would think alloy mag ricochet rounds, which I love, hammer forged and full bore. So we have the Vision Sidearm. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I did not tell you guys. Sorry about that. And with the Range Masterwork. The Range is already a 66. Throw the Range Masterwork on there. It's going to be nice. Uh, the Vision with One for All, which I'm not a fan of. Uh, surplus, Steady Rounds, Alloy, tar Target and Control with a Handling Masterwork. Look at that stability. Through the freaking roof, man. I tell you what. You grab this. And you throw that full auto retrofit on, that thing's going nowhere. The range isn't great, man, but oh my god, that stability. You know what? One for all, but ah, see, that's what kills it for me. That one for all. Hitting three separate targets increases damage for a moderate duration and surplus. Uh, it's just that mod, man. Otherwise, that might be a fun little sidearm, man, to play with. So we got Funnel Web, of course, with Vice Stinger, Focused Fury. Dealing half of the magazine is precision damage, grants the weapons bonus damage. The shot count is reset whenever the weapon is reloaded or stowed with a 38-round mag, 900 RPM, this thing, choose. Steady hands. Kills provide improved handling for all weapons for a short duration. Look at that stability in the handling already, though. 59 and 78. Tactical steady rounds, corkscrew, and extended barrel. With a handling masterwork. Uh, that handling is going to be through the roof on this, man. Uh, if you don't have one you like, I uh, which is crazy because these things drop like nuts for me. If you don't have one you like, I would say pick this one up. Because that handling and the handling masterwork, bro, your handling is going to be through the roof. Your stability is already awesome. You know what I mean? So pick this one up for sure. Give it a shot. Fall in love with it. And then start farming your own. Typhon Grenade Launcher 5 with uh, Omelon Fluid Dynamics. One for all again. Demolitionist, High Explosive Ordnance, Sticky Grenades, Hard Launch, Confined, and with a Velocity Masterwork. Then we have the Crown Splitter Sword with Surrounded, which I, I think is awesome for swords. Uh, Thresh, Heavy Guard, Enduring, Honed, and Jagged Edge with a Impact Masterwork at 71 that swing speed is horrible, but the thing hits like a brick and house. Man, I'm just saying. I'm trying to censor myself there. So let's um let's go ahead and take a, a long walk down here to Ada Wan. Let's see what she has. Man, uh drop down in the comments below, man, and um and say hi, you guys. It's uh it's been a while since I've uh, I've been on and know and I apologize for that, man, but like I said, life's just keeps Smacking me in the face, man, and 
Sometimes I don't know what to do, but it seems my friends and family always pull me back. So here I am, ready to make some more content for you guys, and uh, ready to show you, man, the life's got some really good things in there, man. Some some really cool stuff like friends, family, man, some activities that you could do together like Destiny Gaming. Oh my God, bro! Like I've said before, and I've I said it, I said it in my about, man. I am a I'm a vet. Titan. And uh, I just, I love the way that the video games pull people together, man. You had a cam camaraderie like I did when I was in service, but but Hello, here we go. See, Ada 1 has, for today, remember, I think these switch daily, uh, linear fusion rifle loader, unflinching sidearm aim. I said that like a question, loader, unflinching sidearm aim, quick charge, become charged with light by rapidly defeating multiple combatants with fusion rifles or shotguns. Greatly increases the ready speed of fusion rifles, shotguns, submachine guns, and sword. But this mod secondary perk is active when at least one of the arc mod is socketed into this armor. Or at least one of the arc charged with light mod is socketed into another piece that you are wearing. Grenade launcher holster. And she has the tangled web piece set. And, uh, and for, uh, yeah, for the transmats and stuff, man, if you guys have them, if you don't like it, it's cool. Just remember, man, every little piece that you have could, could like, a leg piece could go with a whole another set's fuck, uh, chest piece and everything else, and and you never know, man. And, hey, I want to appreciate you guys for tuning in. I know there's so many other places to go, man, but thank you for stopping in and saying hi and dropping a like, man. Hit that like and subscribe. we got a long way to go. I'm trying to climb my way back up to 1,000, man. So let's, uh, let's see what we can do. I love you guys, man, and you guys have a great day. Be good to yourselves firstly and then be good to each other man we need that more than ever right now love you guys